smoke here. Pads are currently open for business. Price is this side of the galaxy. You check.
Halt! Identify yourself immediately! Havoc Squad, pleased to meet you. What? I thought Havoc Squad was on our side now, Serge? We'll figure it out when they're dead. Open fire! of your base. Tell me that and you can go. Base. Base coordinates. Here. On this data... data pad. Please. Mercy. Mercy. You're free to go, soldier. Thank you for your cooperation. Thank you. Thank you. Lieutenant! Lieutenant, can you hear me? This is Oleg Claret. Are you there, Lieutenant? I read you loud and clear. He was just called. He said Colonel Gorick is pulling out. He's going to run for it, Lieutenant. That scum killed dozens of innocent people for his tests. Those people deserve justice. Their families deserve justice. Please hurry, Lieutenant. Gorick has to pay for what he's done. I'll move out immediately, sir. You've got him on the run. Now finish him off. Good luck, Lieutenant. Clarin, uh, Clarin out. Uh, right. are currently open for business.
Lieutenant. You made it just in time. Gorik called for a full-scale evacuation. He's already at the hangar in the back of the base overseeing the evacuation, and he has my bomb designs with him. Please, you have to get to the landing area and stop Gorik before he escapes with my bomb designs. Gorik won't escape from me. If anyone can do it, it's you. Good luck, Lut. Warning. Warning. Self-destruct sequence initialized. All personnel must evacuate to the hangar area immediately. This is not a drill. Countdown sequence initialized. Warning. Warning. Facility detonation imminent. Oh no, we're too late. The entire base, it's gonna be vaporized. We're, we're out of time. There must be some way to shut down the self-destruct sequence. You'd have to go to the command center to cancel the detonation, and well, you could even unlock myself from there. But by the time you reach the command center and stop the explosion, Gork will have escaped with my bomb designs. That can't happen. I'm sure I can stop the explosion and get Gorik if I move fast enough. No. No, you have to leave me. By the time you cancel the self-destruct, Gork will be long gone. Please, there isn't time to argue. It's down to me or the bomb designs, and, well, there's only one good choice there. I've made my choice, and I'm getting you out of here. Forget about me! Stop Gorik. Keep the Empire from getting my designs. That's all that matters. We'll track down that imp scum before he gets too far. You can't know that for sure. And how many people might die in the meantime? Please, Lieutenant, don't let Gorik escape just for me. Please don't do it. Lieutenant, I, I guess I should thank you. You saved my life after everything. I did what seemed right. Well, I'm still not so sure it was the right thing to do, but... It, well, thanks. Still, it... Well, it's hard knowing my designs might be hurting innocent people. I helped Gorik. Help, helped a monster. It's unforgivable. That monster is going to face justice. I hope so. Before... <laughs> Well, before anyone else gets hurt. Okay then, let's, uh, go. Consider me officially surrendered, Lieutenant. I'll stay where you can see me. It's a long trip back to Coruscant. I'm ready, Lieutenant. Squad, hold up! Get me a solid perimeter ASAP! You must be the commander of Havoc Squad. I'm Lieutenant Tasser, sir. 43rd Advanced Recon Squad. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? General Garza rerouted us from a two-week sightseeing up on Ryloth to assist you, Lieutenant. Looks like you've already taken care of things, though. The mission was a complete success. Garza mentioned a possible prisoner for us to haul back to Coruscant. Is this the guy Garza was talking about? Treat him well, Lieutenant. He's a valued ally. Are you... Do you mean that, Lieutenant? Wow, I... Thanks. I guess I'll... see you around then. Good luck. 
I'm glad you chose the right side in the end, Fuse. Thanks, Lieutenant. So am I. All right, people, let's move out. I want a full sweep through this facility for intel. Good meeting, Lieutenant. Maybe we'll see you around later. Let's go, people! Lieutenant, you made it! Please, have a seat. Tell me what happened. Was your mission against the Imperials a success? I can't discuss the details. Oh. Oh, uh, yes, of course. I understand. Top secret mission, of course. Well, could you at least tell me about Fuse? I mean, did you rescue him from the Imperials? All of the details about Fuse are classified, I'm afraid. Shame. I really took a liking to him. Be nice to know if he made it out safe. So, your general called while you were gone. I filled her in on what I knew. Nice lady. Stern, though. Don't get me started on General Garza. Anyway, she wants you to call her from your ship before you take off. She was pretty insistent about it, actually. I hope there's nothing wrong. There's no predicting with Garza. You accomplished some great things here. I can't imagine she's anything but pleased. Well, Lieutenant, the people of Anchorhead owe you an incredible debt. You've saved countless lives from a threat we never could have imagined. I managed to scrape together a small reward for you. It's the least we could do to thank you. No reward is necessary. That's generous of you, Lieutenant. I know the people affected by these bombings will really appreciate it. So, I guess this is where we part ways. It's been a real pleasure having you here, Lieutenant. An honor. We'll never forget what you've done for us. The Republic prides itself on protecting the innocent. Be sure the Republic knows how much we appreciate the help. Good luck, Lieutenant. You'll always be welcome in Anchorhead. Command sending out new tactics all the time. Stay sharp out there. Even Havoc Squad can learn from a veteran. Stay sharp out there.
Lieutenant, thank you for calling. From what I hear, you've been very busy. We have quite a bit to discuss. First, congratulations on stopping the bombings in Anchorhead. Mayor Claren was both impressed and grateful. Well done. Glad I could make a difference. You've represented the Republic very well in this. Good job. I also understand that you not only located Fuse, but routed an entire Imperial Research Facility in the process. Lieutenant Tasser filed his report only moments ago, actually. I'm sorry he and his men couldn't arrive sooner. Lieutenant Tasser was very helpful, General. I'm glad to hear it. Tasser reports that you brought Fuse in alive and without resistance. Cardin will be pleased. He had begun to doubt our commitment to bring the Havoc traders in safely. I never could have pulled this off without him. Yes, Mayor Claren indicated that as well. I'm pleased that Fuse could see the error of his ways. What about the bomb designs that Fuse created for the Imperials? Were you able to retrieve a copy? The Imperials fled with the designs while I was saving Fuse. I'm glad you managed to bring Fuse in alive, Lieutenant. But letting those designs slip away will carry a heavy cost. Still, your mission was largely successful. You are to be congratulated. Sir, I need to speak to you immediately. I've received a strange hollow message that appears to bear... Imperial signal codes. I haven't watched it yet. I wanted you present to supervise and confirm that I'm not engaged in secret communications with Imperial personnel. We'd better watch it immediately. Yes, sir. I'll load it now. Laura, it's me, Alexei. I... I hope you're well. It's been a long time. Alexei? Sir, this message is from my brother. I don't know what to say. I know this must be hard for you. It's more surprising than anything. I... I honestly never thought I'd see his face again. I'm sorry to contact you like this, but I need your help. My men and I... We're as good as dead. We're on Nar Shaddaa. We were caught tampering with one of the Hut's operations. We never dreamed the slugs would have so much security. These Hut's are Imperial allies, Alara. There is no rescue team. We'll be disavowed and left to die. Please. You're my only hope now. Get your brother out of there, Alara. You've got my leave. Thank you, sir. I appreciate your willingness to help, given the circumstances. I believe I can bring him to our side. I know my brother better than anyone. I can convince him to defect. Perhaps it's best if I see to this matter alone, sir. Alexei will be much easier to convince if he doesn't feel outnumbered. If you can bring him in willingly, then all the better. Coordinates are included at the end of the message. I'll prep my gear for search and rescue. The operation was a complete success, sir. Per code 23 of the Enemy Interaction Guidelines, Alexei officially defected to the Galactic Republic. Given the circumstances, we didn't have much time to catch up, but I have my brother back. Thank you for allowing me to help him. I'm happy to hear that everything worked out. Hopefully Personnel Division will allow me to stay in contact with Alexei. Not privately, of course, and help guide him through the defection process. I should start compiling notes for him. Thanks again, sir. So, I found our first potential target for the Morale Improvement Initiative. An Imperial propagandist known as the Ambassador. I've collected a sample of his lies for your review. Friends, the Ambassador will have you know that you needn't live in fear. You needn't bow to men who are your inferiors. In the Empire, you can live a life of purpose and accomplishment, where only those most fit to rule guide our society. A life of greatness. Give me our intel on this guy. The SIS has found no concrete data. He effectively has no personal history before becoming the Ambassador. Clearly an Imperial cover-up. These spurious recordings are broadcast all over the galaxy, filling people with doubts about our noble cause. The Ambassador is the public face of our enemy, 
Removing him will boost Republic troops' morale and combat effectiveness. As soon as you locate the Ambassador, let me know. You'll be the first person I notify, sir. Sir, we've had a breakthrough. The Ambassador has been spotted. He's staying in a suite at the Star Cluster Casino on Narshada. If I move quickly, I can take him before he's relocated. Sounds like a plan, Forex. Or the Republic! Sir, I am pleased to report that the mission was a complete success. Though the Ambassador had 15 armed guards in his casino suite, I managed to storm through them all, grab the lying fool, and leap out through the window. Is the Ambassador still in one piece after that? Of course, sir. Having timed my assault perfectly, the Ambassador and I landed on a passing Ognaught salvage scow after a mere 130 meter fall. Once I had made my apologies to the proprietors of the scow, I turned my prisoner over to the SIS, and the toll of liberty rang out across the galaxy. Excellent work, Forex. Now that the Ambassador's influence won't be spewing across the galaxy, I suspect we'll see a marked improvement in Republic morale. The only problem now will be selecting an even more impressive target. <laughs>